Good evening, everyone. This is Deacon Up coming to you again from Power in Unity Ministries. I have heard so many people that are down and disheartened that it just breaks my heart. So right now, in the name of Jesus, before I say anything else, I come against that spirit of depression and oppression and possession. How dare you invade the body of Christ? How dare you cause anger and dismay and dis- despair and despondency in the body of Christ. Right now, we call forth the warring angels to push them back into outer darkness. We call forth those ministering angels to restore, repair, and refresh the soul of your people, Lord. In the name of Jesus, you have given us that authority. You have no right. You have invaded private property, and we command by the name of Yeshua that you leave. You take your imps with you. No longer will we tolerate this in our lives. Restore, refresh, and repair as only you know how, Lord. We praise you and we glorify you. Praise be unto God. Thank you, Jesus. I wasn't going to say this, but Yesterday, I was on my way to the store and to, to get Bob some medicine, et cetera, et cetera. And, and I kept seeing this vision. I was just going down the road, speaking in a heavenly language, just letting, you know, e- encouraging myself in the Lord. And I begin to see this demons. Now, I know we see pictures and depict, but I literally saw when I, see, I began to just say, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, just his name, Yeshua, Yeshua, Yeshua. And when I spoke the name, those demons, though they were they were red in color and they bowed down to the ground, their head even bowed to touch the ground. And in their hand, there was like a pitchfork. And I know we've seen this in movies, but I'm telling you, I saw the pitchfork and I saw the forked tail. And I, then I, he began to show me how that pitchfork and pick and poke and pinch and pull and tear at the heart and the and the and the uh the 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 in Jesus name they begin to tear at the heart and they begin to tear at the the faith that they had in Christ it was happening all over the body of Christ but then all of a sudden in their ugliness that I saw and what they were doing, I saw them stand upright. And as they stood upright, they became just like you and me. It could have been a person that you met in a store. It could be somebody that you met as you were at the gas station. It could be somebody, a friend or a person in your family. Whatever it was, they were appearing to be what they were not. You hear what I'm saying? This was the vision I was seeing all the way to the store yesterday. I had no intentions of revealing this, but that is what I saw. They appeared to be what they were not. Hear what he's saying. Remember way back several years ago, he said, all are not who you think they are and everything is not what it seems. And he also said in those same time frame, out of Hollywood would come truth. Hear what he is saying to you. Hallelujah. Messiah. No longer will depression reign in the body of Christ. You are born again. You have been washed in the blood of Jesus and the devil has no right over your mind, your, your spirit or your body. 
You hear what I'm saying? You come up out of that bed and you come out of that place, that corner that he's pushed you in. You come out of it like a raging lion for Jesus Christ. How do you do that? You say to me, I say to you, quote the word and change the atmosphere. Quote the word and change the atmosphere. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. The earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof and all that dwells therein belongs to him. You begin to quote scripture, holiness unto the Lord. Rejoice in the Lord and always again I say rejoice my Lord and my God. Shandai, that'll have to be for tomorrow. I was going to quote another one, but I just want to tell you right now, you, you begin to fill the air around you with scripture and speak it out loud. The spirit of God needs to hear what the mouth is speaking. Praise be unto God. That was all free. Glory be to God. Now let's get into what he's saying. And it kind of goes right along with this because he begins saying, I am aware of your emotions and feelings and the enemies used to deceiving. He has come this morning to discourage your heart, sending angels to catch Oh, I'm sorry. I got it mixed up. Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. Let me calm down. Let me calm down. Let me calm down and give this to you like Jesus wants. I'm so mad at the devil. I could just scream. My Lord and my God, I know what I know, what I know he must bow when you say you're sure. The Christ, the anointed one, Emmanuel, God with us, he's got to bow. Stop the assignment. You hear what I'm saying? Take authority in Jesus' name. He gave it to us. In my name, cast out demons. In my name, see the lame walk and miracles, signs and wonders. My Lord and my God, let me start over. I am aware, Jesus said, of emotions and feelings and the how the enemy is deceiving. But I, he says, have come this morning to encourage your heart, sending angels to catch the enemy's fiery dart. Does he read your mind or what? When the enemy comes with a fierce attack, no, I have always got your back. Angels ascending and descending as America, I have begun to rearrange. Hallelujah. When he spoke those words, I couldn't do anything but just begin to pour my heart out. And he put it in the rhyme. Your colors, gold, silver, diamonds, and emerald green, your brightness destroys the enemy's plans and schemes. <laughs> Thank you for your strength in my weakness. You came in your power and your gentleness. The Holy Ghost comes powerful, but like a gentle breeze, always he puts my mind at ease. I am so grateful for your love, your mercy, and your power. That is, you're so watchful over us every minute and every hour. You are my life, my breath, my all in all. My heart knows you will not let me fall. My goal, walking close to your side, worshiping and lifting you high. As you guide my feet and teach me to fly, teaching me to climb the mountain so high, may the heavens rejoice in a resounding ring as I praise and worship and a song to you I sing. This just began to pour out of me as he talked to us this morning, my Lord and my God. Then he goes on and he says, time for change, time to expect it, expose the enemy to 
See lost souls, the many, quickly their feet upon another path as I begin to change this to that, my Lord and my God. You will see me move across this land, swooping the enemy with my left hand. The army I have been preparing on their vesture, no fear they are wearing. Truth unveiled, enemy exposed. He has lost his feeling. Down he goes. <laughs> Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Did you hear that? Truth unveiled, enemy exposed. He has lost his footing. Down he goes. Stay focused on me and you will see. Many return on bended knee, my Lord and my God. Hallelujah. Time and space belong to me, Jesus says. Most much rearranging you are about to see. As I visit the four corners of the earth, many will experience the new birth. Woo, hallelujah. Promises, hallelujah. The end time harvest, glory be to God. The enemy will arise with fear and dread. My church arises cutting off his head. <laughs> Ooh, hallelujah to the Lamb. Do you hear what he's saying? My Lord, the power that is in us, if we just rise up with that power and that authority in his name and rebuke what the enemy is trying to do. I got to repeat that. Time and space belongs to me. Much rearranging you're about to see. As I visit the four corners of the earth, many are experiencing the new birth. The enemy will arise with fear and dread. My church arises cutting off his head. Ooh, hallelujah. Glory be to God. Then he says, a miracle will rise, a beacon to all, as together we bow, and on me they call. Fear and dread will crumble at your feet as you see the enemy falling in defeat. Look up and shout and sing to your Lord, your Master, and your King. Hallelujah. This is who lives in here. This is what he's going to work, the works he's going to do through you. Hallelujah. You will see my church alive and well as I paralyze the host of hell. You hear what he is saying. Rise up, church. Never forget my son on the cross. Remember always who is in charge. I am the boss. Hallelujah. Christ is yes, truth, and amen. And he will be with you till the very end. My Lord and my God. He's got a little more to say. He says, and then this is another revelation and encouragement. Look between the lines. So much revelation, so much encouragement, so much power and authority that is belongs to the body of Christ. He says, summer is about to end. Your journey will take a new trend. As sure as the ocean touches the shores, I will begin opening new doors. The desert Plots you have endured, my word, my promises are assured. Your hopes and your dreams, your heart, our hearts the same. Together we walk souls to gain. Expand your thoughts, your dreams to see. I will show you the universe in 3D. Woo, only God can do that. Hallelujah. You'll see through everything as it'll all become transparent. Hallelujah. Satan's fall, his plan, my church to deceive, spreading doubt and fear, he tries to weave. But my church, victorious is my plan, the execution for sure, because I am that I am. Hallelujah. 
Dusty roads, worn feet, and tattered clothes as through life's fire, storms, and woes cause of a battle's wounds and scars. Your blessings will number as the stars. You hear? God knows. He said right at the beginning, he says, I am aware of emotion and feeling and how the enemy is trying to deceive. This is what he's saying. Hear what he's saying as I read it again. Dusty roads. Don't think he don't know. Worn feet, tattered clothes as through the life's fires, storms and woes causes causes all the battle, wounds, and scars. Your blessings, because you held on and went through it all, will be outnumbered the stars. Hallelujah. I am so looking forward to those new open doors. For I am the creator of all. You are in my hand, and I will not let you fall. Earth is my footstool and heaven is my space. I watch, I see as you run your race. Angels, I said, when weariness I find to surround you just in time, my Lord and my God. Your tears turn to joy as you see souls refreshed and restored come to me. Your excitement and weariness I see soon you will taste of my true victory. Wonders, miracles, signs from me, my plans and thoughts coming to fruition, you will see. We are a chosen generation, people. Many things your eyes will see as you worship always looking to me. Be watchful and be alert. The corners are sharp and turns are swift. But through it all, I am is in the mist. Nothing happens that he does not see. I am the rock in which you planched your feet. Through the desert storms, you have stood the heat. The wind may blow, the trees may bend, but I am with you to the very end. Oh, hallelujah. What a powerful word to us today. There was a pause in what he was speaking. And then all of a sudden, this is what I heard. Do you know who I am? I spoke and my spirit began to act. Light upon earth, waters move back. I am the God of the universe, and I am the air you breathe. I am light in the midst of the storms. I am love immeasurably. I am goodness, mercy, and grace throughout each day. Do you know who I am? Ponder upon his word. Let us pray. Precious, holy, awesome God, we worship you. During the storms, the rain, or even when the sky is blue. We, you are all in all wrapped up in one, Father, Holy Ghost, and Son. We praise you for the changes that are coming as to the cross we see souls running. You are the ancient of days, righteousness in all your ways. Thank you for watching over all who are yours and crushing our enemy to the core. Our lives through life storms, we may get tossed, but we always know who is boss. You are Holy Spirit. We are Holy Spirit led. So there is no fear or dread. Thank you for the use of your name, taking authority over sickness and pain. You warn us of the enemy's plots and tell him when to stop. Our trust and faith is in you alone. For many seeds of love in us you have sown. May you be lifted high for all to see. You are God. There is no other with you. Your grace, us, you do cover. 
blessings and honor, praises too, for who you are and for all you do. Amen and amen. Our hearts cry out to you in your pain and in your distress. God will give you rest. Know how much I love you, but God loves you so much more.